no sign of him, my lord. Harry Potter. The boy who lived. Come to die. Something worth living for. And the wonderful prizes they get. I just love to keep them shiny for the good children. And, oh, look at the beautiful things. I can put this there. And a shiny, shiny. Keep it all shiny. It's beautiful. Yes. Oh, the winner. Look at that winner. 1968. That's beautiful. Wonderful. Oh, this is different. This is new. Oh. all your clean clothes out for you, so don't worry, okay? All right, go, go. I'm at work. All right, bye. Oh my God, what's going on here? someone steal the trophy when there's more expensive things to steal? They're 
call somebody. Yeah. Hello. Is that the Ministry of Magic? Yeah, Mr. Edwards, please. Yeah, it's very urgent. Okay, I'll hold. <laughs> reporting for The Daily Prophet. I'm here to interview the headmaster, Mr Murphy, about the missing trophy and who's working for the Dark Lord. Who do you think stole the trophy? Is it you? No, you no. haven't been very good record with the Ministry of Magic, have you? No. Uh, no, I don't have a good record with the Ministry of Magic. But it isn't me. Uh, it's a tricky one, this, isn't it? So, who is working in cahoots with the Dark Lord? Could it be Miss Staples? Mm. Could it be Mr. Dix? Could it be you? Could it be me? It's not me. It's not me. I think it's Miss Cooper. But see, you spent some time in the prison of Azkaban. What crime did you commit that you've been so secretive about? And why are your powers revoked? Uh, I'm afraid I'm unable to comment. Um, and this interview is about the safety of the students at DSTC. This is not about the crimes that I've committed in the past. This is not about why my powers have been revoked, and I think you're overstepping the grounds as usual. You're being very defensive, that's suspicious really. Sure you didn't do it? Because I think you did it. I didn't do it. Absolutely not. Not with a capital N and a capital O and a capital T. Okay, well, you said you were going to protect your students, so how are you going to do that then? It's a good question. I've been in contact with the Minister of Magic, and he has promised me he has said that he has done everything in his power to make sure that we are protected from the Dark Lord himself. Thank you. This is Rita Scruta reporting from Daily Prophet. As Minister of Magic, it is my duty to tell you that there has been some serious goings on at DSTC and the trophy that we've had in the school cabinet has been stolen um, overnight. We need your help to sort this problem out. We think that he who should not be named has got some friends in the school that have been helping him and we shortlisted five people. Mr Murphy, Mr Dix, Miss Cooper, Miss Staples and also Dobby the school elf. Over the next week we would like you to find out some clues that have been positioned around the school to help us identify who is helping Lord Voldemort. But be very, very careful because there are some spells and some nasty things that could happen to you. But please try your best. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs>